Well, folks, we are two weeks away from the biggest weekend in fashion for Portland with Fashion Next. As Fashion Next media partner, Coin6 and KRCW want to keep you in the know about all the fun fashion moments about to hit the runway. And to break it all down, I have Everyday Northwest Jeremiah Stroop with me in studio today. Hi, Jeremiah. Good morning. What's up, Ali? Oh, my gosh. Yes, this is going to be an epic fashion event. We're oh so my gosh. excited. Of course, you cannot have an awesome runway show without a couple models stretching and their stuff and mm -hmm. we have Dylan Jackson, Kayla Tatum here in the house to represent as Fashion Next Models. How are you two doing? Good, how are doing you doing? Great. Awesome. I it's know. great to have the both of you here. We have a lot of questions for you about the experience with Fashion <laughs> Next and if you want to go to Fashion Next right now and get 10% off your tickets, use the code EDNW. So when did you both start modeling? I started modeling at the age of 14. I grew up very shy to myself, and I was scouted in a mall, Washington Square Mall, with my dad. Work. And um, the agent was um, very excited to have me um, go to the casting call, and they signed me at the age of 14, and they were also partnered with Ford Models. So I got a lot of experience, built my portfolio, and yeah, I kept continuing to grow from there. And Amazing. your first time at Fashion Next was 2018. Yes. And you got to walk with Mondo Gira, who's going to be back this year. Is that right? Yes, yes. I'm super excited to be walking for Mondo again. Um, I grew up watching Project Runway, and mm -hmm. Mondo yeah. is always my favorite designer. And his designs are very fun, loud colors and prints. So I'm really excited to be walking from Mondo again. We see you're not afraid of a little color <laughs> over there today with no. that nice orange jacket. <laughs> love it, now love it. Now the veteran's here, but the newbie is Dylan mm -hmm. Jackson. Yeah. Went to the casting call. Uh, Coin6 covered that, and you got selected, and this is your first runway show. Correct, yeah. How are you feeling about stepping onto that runway it's, for the first time? It's going to be exciting. Um, it's my first time, so I am a little nervous, but um, we'll see how it goes. And yeah. how many designers are you walking for? I was originally just supposed to be walking for Mondo, um, but okay. then there were a couple cancellations, so I'm now walking for six designers <gasps> in total. Yeah. Zero to 100 real quick, yeah. you know oh what I'm saying? Oh my <laughs> gosh, I love it. And speaking of zero to 100, the two of you are in a good amount of promotional material for Fashion Next. So being able to walk around this beautiful city and see your face here and there and everywhere when it comes to Fashion Next, how is that for the two of you? It's amazing. Like, it's just, it's really a great experience and to be a part of this production, um, I'm really thankful that they had me a part of the promotional material and looking forward to modeling this year. Mm -hmm. Of course, still. There's it is very exciting to see all the professional footage and be like part of the community in that way. Absolutely. Speaking of community, yes, because mm -hmm. there's billboards and bus ads, and of course we're getting all geared up to take over the Big Pink. Yes. Which is an iconic skyscraper in downtown Portland for this very iconic fashion event. And so what do you feel this brings to the community to get folks, you know, downtown Portland, dressed up, experiencing fashion? How do you feel about being part of that? And why is Fashion X important to the Portland community? Well, it's great because um, fashion kind of works as like a motive for art. So this yeah. is just another platform that Portland has to put artists on display. Yes, and piggybacking off of that, um, it's great to bring the community together and an excuse to dress up, <laughs> make, see some familiar faces, listen to some good music. And yeah, bringing the community together is, is awesome. It's not just a runway show, as so many people know. There's a marketplace as things kind of get warmed up in the evening with mm -hmm. local businesses and brands. Of course, the epic runway shows, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And then it wraps up with an after party, which I know you kind of referenced, because <laughs> the celebration of fashion and fun still has to go on throughout the night. Absolutely. It never stops, and it sounds like such a cool experience. So thank you so much, Kayla and Dylan, for visiting us. And Jeremiah, a little birdie told me you'd be there to help all week long to bring the fashion to Studio B here is that correct <laughs> well we are going to call this the fashion next sneak peek week okay love as it. we gear up and of course as you mentioned earlier we do have a promo code for our loyal viewers 10 percent off if you use ednw so definitely go and cash in that discount so you can come experience all the fashion and fun and of course next week our official fashion next week i'll be mm -hmm. here every day with ali and some of the other incredible individuals making this the biggest epic event in downtown portland possible absolutely and definitely Mark your calendars for October 3rd through the 5th at the Big Pink Building in downtown Portland for all things fashion next. Thank you all so much for coming through again. It's of great course. to have you. Mm 